Next-generation Ford Focus has been tested in some of the most extreme locations on the planet to ensure robust and proven reliability and dependability. These camouflage pre-production models are being put through their paces high in the Austrian Alps to evaluate how they perform in high altitudes. This stunning stretch of road is the Großglockner High Alpine Road. It's 48 kilometers long, has 36 challenging bends, and most importantly, it climbs above 2,500 meters. Uh, our specific testing is a high altitude testing from a customer point perspective. So we're looking for drivability and every other aspect a customer may experience if he drives up the hill. Uh, we're doing mainly the uphill driving and uh, there the, 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 the cooling aspect for the engine is the uh, most critical. So uh, it's radiator fluid and, um, and engine oil and for the automatic transmission cars also automatic transmission oil. Um, but for downhill driving, which we don't really uh, test, it's also the brakes. So you need to really care for your brakes if you go down. Each Focus is equipped with hundreds of sensors that give an incredibly detailed picture of how the vehicle is affected by reduced oxygen levels at high altitudes. The cars carry plastic fuel cans filled with ballast to simulate three heavy adults sitting in the rear seats. On the hill, going up, the test drivers push the Focus hard. Some critical customers are driving fast, but not, not really to the limit. And uh, that's what we're trying to, to simulate. Uh, you have pretty good road conditions here, and uh, you have a 12% grade uh, all over the uh, uphill driving. And uh, that's the easiest way to, to get uh, good test results for us. And it's a long, long road, uh, really good for testing. Ford also tests with heavy trailers hitched to the back of the Focus. This puts even more stress on the engine, transmission and clutch. In high altitude you get uh, thinner air when you lose engine power and maybe you're not able to pull the whole weight up the hill. That's why we really t test the limit uh, how, how many uh, weight you can pull up the hill here. Clutch is also one element. Uh, if you need to launch here at, at uh, these, these grades, it's very stressy for the, for the clutch. But the other thing is the engine temperatures and the loss of power, of course. You need to keep the power to, to get the trailer up the hill. Bernd has driven thousands of kilometers in the next generation Focus. So how does it compare to its predecessor? Yeah, you really need to drive one after the other. And uh, the current Focus is quite a really, really good car. And uh, in every attribute aspect, uh, this car is going to, to be better.